Welcome back to the Electrician's Tool Channel. Today I just want to show y'all um, my electrical panel for my home. And this is a this is a, a transfer uh, generator, a portable generator transfer switch right here. Uh, it's by a company called Reliance, Reliance Controls. And it's a manual, tra uh, manual transfer uh, switch for portable generators. Category number is R510A. Maximum wattage, it, take, it takes to be uh, 12,500. And uh, it, it's 100 amp. <clears throat> and it's for outdoors. It's, a, it's an outdoor control cabinet. And since we have a lot of time on my hand now, since there's all this stuff is going on in the world right now, I thought I'll just go ahead and hook it up. Uh, this, it doesn't stay open like this at all. This is a cover that goes on it. This, it's still brand new in the box. Once I run my my uh, once I run my my, my wires and all, it'll, it'll be I put these wires these wires are going and I'm, I'm planning on taking this here. I'm gonna get some seal tight. Well, I have some already came with this. I'm gonna use a, a, a seal tight uh, a conduit. That's what we call it here in the states. A seal tight a conduit, and I'm gonna run it to my main panel through this side or this side, depending on what side I'm put put it on my panel outside my distribution panel outside my home. And I'm um, gonna run these wires through there into my main panel, and uh, this this will be closed up after that, and it's gonna seal all that up. But this is this is a night, and it'll be, and I'm gonna plug the generator up from the bottom. That's what you see right here. Uh, that's why I plan on plugging the generator up on this right here. That's 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 the plug, and um, we have um, a double pole twenty amp, uh, two twenty amp breaker, no four. And one, two, three, four, five, six, 15 amp breakers. This should be enough to run a lot of stuff. The main appliances in my home, uh, refrigerators, uh, uh, freezers, and a AC units and things. Well, not some, yeah, window units, but I don't have window units. I have central air. So uh, if, if all else fails, I have to put a, a, a window unit in. If we were to lose power, I can. But uh, a lot of the main components, essential comp uh, components in the house, I'll be able to run it. If need be, uh, where I live at, we don't have that many power outages. But um, you know, I bought this uh, a couple of years ago, about two years ago, and never really got a chance to put it up. Um, no, never got around to put it up. But uh, since I have a chance to put it up now, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I have a lot of time on my hand, and um, hopefully it'll be up by next week. I, I'm gonna get started on it next week for sure. No, this weekend for sure. But um, this is a, uh, a transfer switch by, like I said, by a company called, made by a company called Reliance. I can't, I wanna show you the front. I, these uh, generator startup procedures, I, I put this up, I got it laminated and put it on here so I won't forget and my wife won't forget how to operate this thing. And even on the front here, I put this 120, it's kind of dusty now though, but I put that up there, the sticker, and I put some varnish over it uh, so it, it'll stay. And if water was to get on, it won't make it peel or anything. So remember, it's going to be outdoors. But so, but this is a this is a nice transfer switch. Um, it's enough for me. And um, I think I'm gonna get me like about a yeah, I'll say about a eight thousand uh, watt generator, maybe a little bit more. Uh, I seen one that I wanted, uh, but I'm gonna get one of those. And I just want to pull this out to let you guys see. How many circuits they have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten circuit generator. And this is how you turn them off and on, whatever, whatever one you're going to use. If you're using the line load, uh, the regular, uh, I mean, once the power come back on, you leave them off. And uh, you want a generator. That's that what you do, put it on there. And that's a transfer switch to transfer it into the house. So, um, I just want to show you guys how it looks. Let me see if I can turn this thing around because it's kind of heavy. It's kind of heavy. Uh, okay, that's the front. Front of it. This is the side of it. It's the back. That's the other side. This is the front, and it had a key that come with it to lock the panel. So, so let me 
gonna show you guys what I got. And um, in the states, sometimes we have um, power outages, and this is why I got that. And I just want to show you guys this out. Maybe give y'all an idea. You may want to hook one up to your home. So I just want to thank you again, and I hope some of y'all found this video useful or helpful. And uh, see, I don't. You know, I wish I could fix it up some kind of way when I install it. I let you guys see. I'm just gonna work on it because I don't have a GoPro camera. But I'm thinking about, uh, maybe I'm just going to hook that up, make that happen so you can see me uh, install this thing. But okay, man, just thank you. Well, I want to thank y'all for stopping by. I hope this video was helpful to, to some of y'all. I hope some of y'all found it interesting. Uh, again, this is the uh, Reliance. I'll show you the name of the company. Reliance. That's everything you need right there. So, okay. Uh, and I also get the little, um, the circuit label, labeler, right here that goes on here. Let me put that in there before I lose it. Thanks, man, for stopping by. Y'all know what to do. Hit that subscribe button. Peace out.